What's going on, everybody? As you welcome back to another episode uh, of some young brothers doing some dope shit. Yes. My name is Heems, as always. Your co-host here, Augusto Cone, looking right there in the camera for you. It's Big Wolf, your mama's favorite boyfriend. And as you guys can tell or cannot tell, we're in a different place right now, yeah. right? This is not the typical bat cave that y'all see us in. <laughs> we're moving up out here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, at, least, yeah, yeah. Hor- at least horizontally we're moving. Yeah. We're moving up. You know, it's not a straight, you know, incline. It's a horizontal incline. It's all right though. Ain't that an incline? I said horizontal. Yeah, whatever. I'm trying to do yeah. science right now. Because you say horizontal <laughs> moving up. So as you I'm guys sorry. know, first thing we start off with is highs and lows. Let's do it. Let's get into or it. Or side to sides, but <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry. he's mad. He's gonna be mad. <laughs> he's this is gonna be the best hot. episode. Yeah. What's, uh, can I go first? <laughs> go first. Let man. me go be my first. Guess. All right. So I actually have a high and a low today, y'all. Okay. I spent a lot of money. I spent a lot of money. Spent a lot okay. of bread. That's Bo- the high, bro. That's the high and the low. Mm-hmm. Bought a new laptop though. I'm, ew, 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 ew. Let the people know how much money you spent. It's about. I think it was like twenty three hundred. Dang. That's for, for a computer. For a computer. For a computer. I got 32 for one of these things. And it was sad. That's yeah, fucking man. ridiculous. I, I, now I can finally run my InDesign while running my Illustrator, while recording the pod, while do your taxes, while doing my taxes. Future. Exactly. Drive your car. And his shit not gonna sound like a jet engine. <laughs> no, no, more, no more. No more. No <laughs> more. So we yeah, in a quiet yeah. room, and that sh- and that shit mm. said, "What the fuck is that fan noise?" <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying we're she done said, with that. We're it's done with like that. Fry, you know when you fry chicken at your mama's house. Oh yeah, you, know, you hear that fan on? Oh, exactly, bro. That's turn the, the fan. Now. The fan. That's really at our house when I make anything. But we'll leave that for another discussion. Oh, in the low. Let me hear this. You know these niggas bet on me. <laughs> oh, they got to bet on you. Oh, they no. got the bro. <laughs> I, I I made I made Ephraim ten dollars. What bet is that? I want to know. Mohammed forgot that he left water on the stove. I burned. <laughs> he burned water, water nigga. <laughs> Can you burn? You burn the pot. Yeah, mean? I burned yes, the pot. The water. Water was, the water, water, was, how water was gone. Water. But that's that's the joke. He I wasted burnt, water. It <laughs> just burned water. California in a drought right now. Oh me, you over and here, I, and I'm over here burning water. You, that's I'm funny. burning water. Yeah. So that's funny. yeah, that that was kind of the low, and also like I said, mini high, kicking it with y'all niggas per usual. Y'all know the vibes. That's my fucking low. But that's all right. <laughs> We what about you, dirty bitch? Anyway, um, who's going next? I'm going go next. My right. high for the week isn't even my high. Okay. My girl graduates tomorrow. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Shouts out Danielle for graduation. Shouts this, out Danielle. Break that fourth wall. What's she's up, been Danielle? In, in this fucking hair game, bro. Two plus years, dog. She's yeah. she's stressed. She's <laughs> big stress. Capital yeah. okay. stress. And but she, she with you, so you know she extra stressed. Exactly. So she, she, exactly. She, she, Absolutely right. But she graduates tomorrow. <laughs> so I'm real happy that I get to be able to spend my time with her every day now, her and my that's son. Beautiful, yeah, that's beautiful, man. So that's my highest. They're going to be braiding together, bro. Oh, you have a family right. that braids Yo, together stays, stays together. together. Y'all stay <laughs> tight like braids. You stay tight like braids. That's, that's your family is. motto, you know bro. Saying, that's bro. what it is. Um, My low of the week, still broke. Oh, yeah. well, this, everything's normal. Just for now, it's still broke. We all broke, nigga. Yeah, just for now. Yeah, what? Get your straps. Yeah. I'm broke. Help me out. Mm. Buy your straps. That's yeah, it. Um, I don't have mine. He don't got his. I need him, my 11 right, straps though. that I own. <laughs> I'm going to tag the business in the, in the bio. Just for y'all. There it right? is. There you it ain't is. never tagged my business or this nigga's business in the bio. ain't never done that. That's, that's crazy. We went all, through like seven drops, <laughs> nigga. He ain't. He, he acted like he First of all, y'all a grown man with the login for the YouTube. Oh, so Y'all know how to do that shit. He That's have an crazy. attitude. What's your high and low? Yeah. Man, <laughs> my high today is seeing my baby mama here right <laughs> next to me. Oh, he mad. I'm sorry. I'm yeah. sorry. I'm not <laughs> no, just, oh. I, honestly, my Dude. high this week is you had a good week. Yeah, bro. I, you I'm been... happy, bro. We get to be all up in here. Come bro. on now. Come on. No. Shout out to Simon. Shout out Bakersfield Simon. Bakersfield Vintage. Eh, 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 eh. Oh, yeah, uh, I guess we should have said that where we was at, huh? Bakersfield Vintage. Yeah, Y'all stupid. ain't know by now, Bakersfield Vintage. If you know, you know. If you don't if you know, know, now you know. know. Oh, oh shit. Finish. Do something. Say I, I can't. Damn. Damn. That that was, was, <laughs> I was in the middle of it. He said, no. <laughs> what, what's your love for the week? What's your love? Uh, my love for the week? I, same as yours, nigga. I ain't making enough money. Same old. Hey, but we made it through another month we made somehow. It through another month. The rent yeah. somehow got, rent paid. got paid. Rent got paid. Bills got paid. paid. Now Some right of them back late. to the fucking rent race. Trying to figure out how next month's rent comes. Exactly. Get paid. They start all over again. <laughs> this shit is exhausting. I just want one month. And you know I don't have to worry about paying rent, bro. It's like you, you get three I mean? days of like just rest until you get that first bill taken out your account. Damn. You like damn. <laughs> Not even that. My, I got a bunch of bills taken out of my account today, bro. I need to get a chance to rest. Damn. Hustling. Yeah. 
But it's all right though. Just make me hustle harder. I don't know what it is. That's it. That is drinking your water. You drinking your water. Drinking your water all the time. I'm saying, see how that beer's coming in. You know he's drinking water. I'm dehydrated. I'm doing something. I'm not doing something. Actually, okay. I'm not doing anything. Actually, until after tomorrow. Maybe we'll see how we'll see how things go. Yeah, I'll have an inside joke. No, you might need to clean the house, bro. I may I wash the dishes. This nigga walked in on me washing dishes, but it's all right though. We're gonna you know clean house. Clean house. Like that's a bad thing. Like he caught you. I don't like doing. I don't like doing. You don't like doing dishes in front like of other dishes, niggas. Though. I don't like doing dishes at all. Period. But you know what? It's all right Especially though. Especially in front of Because my nigga. girl gonna come home to a clean house. That's all that matters. Right? Look at you. Right. But what's on the docket today? What's on the docket today? <coughs> oh, I know. Let me ask you guys a question. Mm-hmm. What are your guilty pleasures? Oh. oh. Specifically for music. Oh. What's the shit that when you listen shit, to that you gotta like Bailey. after you like drop the homies mm-hmm. off, then you can like safely turn this shit on, bump it. What's your guilty pleasure? B E R um Night Begins to Shine. What's that? Tell, what tell the, the hell is that? that? Yeah, well, I don't even know. You want me to play it? No. Uh, no, we're it's not a, getting it's just, a, yeah. just put it just post. Just it's have like, the production team put it, put a little sample in post. I got you. But it's like no, basically don't do that. We're like the 70s. Claim. Oh shit, yeah. Don't, yeah, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't I'm going to just put the album in the song. How about that? Just do that. Just put it in the production. You said it first. Just put it in. He ain't never been to none of the production meetings. Ain't never brought us donuts. First of all, y'all not going to do that. But all right, go ahead. Keep going. Nah, but um, it's just like a, it sounds like a 70s rock song. Really like LSD tones, like literally. So is sound- it like? Do you know who LCD Sound Systems is? No, I do okay, not. I never but remember. if you see like a van with a uh, crazy art spray painted on the side, side, like the mystery machine. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Or like a dragon on with a white bitch on it, just floating through the sky. That's what the music sound like. All right, that's dope. Yeah. It's so really that's nice. some shit that you like you wouldn't listen to I while would you was not no no <laughs> I mean I I fucked up one time and the homies was in, in the, the shuffle whip. yeah and I was like oh uh, oh shit I, I couldn't get to it and niggas was like bro what? Well, I, I don't know if I got any music on my phone that would be considered a guilty pleasure for me you got an iPod you don't let niggas know about nah I don't got any more iPod I just YouTube that shit when I'm at home by myself <laughs> you do one of these <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah I just yeah. open the door look out the window. <laughs> <laughs> all right, it's cool. Let me just go on. My guilty pleasure, Lady Gaga, but specifically, wow, specifically Don't like say Poker Face, like like the maybe the first maybe twenty songs she's ever made, bro. Wow. Like you throw on like so monster Poker ball Face, shit. Mon- yeah. you throw on uh Bad, bad Man. Rom- I know Bad Romance by bad Heart. Bad Romance is hard. I didn't go lie to y'all out there. I know Bad right. Romance by bad Heart. Bad Romance is my shit. You throw on what's that joint she had with uh Beyonce? You know they both have oh yeah, yeah, both yeah. telephone. Oh, hey, that's yeah, 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 What's yeah, the yeah, other yeah. one? I don't remember. I don't know, but I don't remember. But the music video for Telephone, bad. Me and my hand remember that one. Yeah, me and my hand. But yeah, that's my go-to pleasure. Like I'll never like play that shit at a party. You know, in a car with y'all niggas. I'm not doing that. But when I'm at home, you feeling down that. a little bit, I throw on some bad romance to give me some good spirits. You, you, you know, don't do it when you're about to beat your meat? Nah, I don't listen to music when I do that. <laughs> you a sick nigga if you do that. You turn on music for yourself? I mean, sometimes. Yeah, you, you know what? But he, he likes to listen to music in his room. That's though, so. exactly. Rub so some, some oil on it. Rub some oil on it. We don't need to know all of that. <laughs> <laughs> Keep that with yourself. They don't need I know to a know. lot about y'all niggas. <laughs> they don't need so to don't know do all that. that. Don't do that. What's your guilty pleasure? Demago, you get out of here. Yeah, right before you dig a hole. I would say my my guilty pleasure song, it was originally some house music, but I realized it's My Chemical Romance of Black Parade. Is that a guilty pleasure, though? It is. It, you, it, like, let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Because of my girlfriend. What? Because. So my you listen chem- to that when she's not around? My, no. <laughs> I can't. My Chemical Romance. My Chemical Romance is 50-50. Or I can say Marilyn uh, Manson. Ma- Marilyn Manson. I'm going to say Marilyn, Marilyn Monroe. Monroe. I yeah, say that's yeah, all the time. Ma- Marilyn Manson. Marilyn Mar- I mean Manson. I mean the Charles beautiful, Manson. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Beautiful People, The Dope Show, all these like those really dark tones and things like that. I don't think that. I think that. I don't know. Like my girl doesn't really rock with it. Like she doesn't yeah. even like the t-shirt. Rock. That's funny. <laughs> but she doesn't even. Uh, but right she there, doesn't boy. really yeah, understand the culture of it and everything. So I think that that's a guilty pleasure. It's something I turn on while I'm just like that. by myself. I, it's funny though, because like when it comes to musical sets, we're all at least now rooted in hip hop, but that's not how we started, right? Nah. At least for me, that's well, not mean, how. Nah. I, mean, I know this. I know this dude didn't start off with hip hop. I didn't start off with hip hop. I still look like I'm like him a chrome man. So I look yeah, at the outfits I, now. I, I don't. <laughs> yeah. I fully immerse myself <laughs> in hip hop culture. Gold chain. But on. you don't want some. So you are appropriating black culture some way somehow, uh, in a way. 
way. Not at all. I'm just tapping into my true nature. Oh, okay. That's what that is. This is what you're supposed to look like. Don't play with me, nigga. Like. I already have a hard time trying to differentiate my likes from his likes. Yeah. All right? <laughs> he had the mo- I was worse. mad. I thought he was going to throw the motocross hoodie on. I saw my I dick. was going and I, to. I wanted you to rock. But I was like, hell I yeah. Go he I didn't go cap, bro. I was going to, but then I was like, I'm about to be in this place in this setting. I got to throw the vape and cause jacket on. <laughs> that's that's true. I just got to. Yes, you know what I mean? It looks like you got it here. Right, I you mean, tell this nigga nah, Simon you're stealing, bro. Nah, nah. <laughs> I got it. Check at, this nigga pockets yeah. before I we leave. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> don't do that shit. Um, <laughs> but yeah, though, because like growing up, I listened to a lot of rock. Like even now, like and I, we just, we keep it a buck, keep yeah. it a straight buck. I throw on some Metallica before I throw on any hip hop. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. All right. right, I know a lot of people sitting there. What the fuck does this nigga know Nobody. about Metallica? <laughs> right, right, right. I like, I like, I like he. That. <laughs> what the fuck does he, he know, know about, about some rock, nigga? Nah. But you know, like earlier today, I was at Inner home. Sandman is a classic. Dog. Anybody Sandman, argues? Anybody? Man. If your head, look, like, look, don't I was at work one time, bro. Uh-huh. Right, and there was a random dude parked in the handicap spot listening to Master of Puppets. Master. But he was listening to it loud <laughs> enough for it to come through the. Uh, he had the windows up. Oh. So I just was like trying to like fake. Do something, just standing yeah. next to the car, yeah. <laughs> so, I could, so I could listen to them. Be like, I was just like on my phone, not even doing shit, yeah, just yeah, swiping yeah. through apps just so I could listen to the song. Yeah, I feel oh. like he could have just played the song on his. But phone. I just, I had to rock I out with my guy. You, you know, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I was at home today trying to figure out, like, do I pick Bon Jovi or Queen? Like, what do I prefer? Ooh, now, as my all time like favorite musical groups, acts, whatever, Bon Jovi. Bon Jovi. Or Queen? Bon Jovi. I don't know. Queen. Though. Queen really? though, Queen's got Freddie Mercury. Are you kidding me? I see. At first, <laughs> I was like Bon Jovi, me? right? But nah, bro. I think Queen got I feel it. Like bang. Bon Jovi got a better band. I'm gonna be. You know what? That's a really good point. Yo, I, I feel, think Bon Jovi. I, mean, I think Bon Jovi's got a better band. But better Freddie Mer- Mercury, is Freddie Mercury lead. is a much better band. lead. Yeah. If Freddie Mercury is on Bon Jovi, I don't know. How that <laughs> <I> don't, <laughs> he just put LeBron on the. Or what if we just the Bon Jovi band was in Queen? Oh, I don't know. You yeah. just put LeBron on the Lakers with Kobe and Pau Gasol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 Odom, yeah. Nigga. yeah, yeah. but I don't know. Rock, like, Rock will always be, like, my go-to. Yeah. I know a lot of people are sitting there like, this nigga's a pose. You know, what the fuck does he know about Rock? Test the you, thing. Look at that put a question in the, yeah. Put a question in the comment if you, section. If you, if you tested my Rockness, put you know, a comment in the question. I don't like question. that. A rockness? I don't know. That's the first it, thing I can think it, of, bro. It sounds like What am I, poorly. an English major, nigga? I don't fucking know words. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, somebody's gonna come get your degree from you. Like, they gonna have to get my uh, cell phone and email uh, password. Because <laughs> I've been lost that bitch. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, I've been lost that motherfucker, bro. That's, That's fucking sick. I said, can I get a new. Mm. A but you new, know, right uh, after y'all comment, you know, your favorite rock song you want to test move, Eames with, I, you better fucking subscribe. Because I'm sick of y'all That's tired of y'all watching the fucking video me. and not really subscribing and all that. Look at you. Watching the video, not subscribing, just taking the ball this good ass content. I'm saying, and not contributing in any type of way. Look, we took we took the bitch. extra step. Look, we in a new setting. Look at this for y'all. For and you subscribe. cutting down Nigga. the episode too. For yeah. y'all, I don't exactly. do this for myself. If it was up to me, I'd do this in my draws. But they don't like that. No, no. Let let the silence. Let the silence ride. <laughs> now go. <laughs> You guys have any other guilty pleasure songs? Any, any other guilty pleasures? I, like I said, be beat me up by uh, Kazette. Um, a classic house song, it, very hard, hard 2017, 2018. Um, outside of that, any A tracks, any fucking so this is bro, music, just like, say you love EDM. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> so, this is music you would typically not listen to with people around, yeah. No, I don't. I made that mistake <laughs> too many times. <laughs> I too who? many times, but at the same time, I'm around y'all niggas now, so I don't mind now. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, Other people, I couldn't nah. see that's the thing, push I, the feeling on, that's yeah. It. That's an old house song. Oh, where? That's, that's another house. song. I remember, like, Guilty Pleasures is hard because, like, it's music you wouldn't typically play around, but yeah. I love it's music. It's good music. Enough. I'll play it with anybody. Yeah. Like, I don't have, like, technically a Guilty Pleasure song. Like, you never catch me in my car playing Lady Gaga, but if the song comes on and I'm around, gonna like, I'm going to sing it. You going to twerk? I'm going to sing it. <laughs> I'm going Let me to catch you twerking it. to Lady Gaga. Gaga. Heter- Let me heter- catch you t- <laughs> to some Germanota. Okay. Um, we don't have that on the side. Saying. To some but Stephanie yeah. Germanota, nigga. Oh, yeah. I have no idea what that is. That's her, that is. That's her name. That's oh her wow, name. we a fake. Oh, di- oh, you know what's funny though? Because I went out with my girl's family like a week ago. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you my girl's mom Gaga. was like, "Let me ask y'all some hip hop questions, right? Some music questions." She watching the podcast. Of course, I hit them all, except Lady Gaga's name. She has like five names. 
and I did not know what the fuck her name was. They're all Man. Italian. I didn't know that. I had no idea. Yeah, but yeah. German note, Lady Gaga, come on the show. Lady Gaga, please come oh. on the show. <laughs> Bring your dogs. Bring me. that meat suit. You're rude. <laughs> You're rude. And like that. <laughs> what did he say? I said, bring her dogs. He said, bring the dogs too. Bring her dogs. stole the dogs. And she got them back. She did? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Oh, okay. Oh, Y'all don't God. keep up with news. Bring the meat suit. You know we just do this shit for fun. We don't give a fuck about pop I guess culture. Not. <laughs> I guess we just not. talk. We just talk in new places. We just happen to put a mic next to it now. All right, let me ask y'all another question. Hit right? it, hit we it, got hit through it. with the, the the guilty pleasures. All right. Most of us, all of us, are in a relationship, actually, right? Yes, yeah. we are. Happy relationship. I love you, yeah. baby. I gotta make sure, bro. She doesn't watch the pod. This is great. I can say anything now. I realize that I be saying First things. First of all, you need to ask her why she don't watch the pod. Bruh, that's the real issue. That's, uh, it's bruh, too long. Bruh, it's too long. She she could watch ten minutes of the that's pod. That's it. That's all. I, that's that's not y'all. Just y'all gotta watch want, the whole thing. I want people to watch enough to get a view. That's I'm, it. That's all I care that, about. Let's change our approach on how we ask the subscribe. Like just watch enough to get a view. Yeah, yeah don't just, be. Yeah. You know, you can leave. You can leave us in the background. You know, you don't really have to watch. I don't give a fuck about the people that watch this shit. Nigga, they don't give a fuck about us. Oh my god. They here. do. I, I, they do. Because we've we seen people we don't normally talk to say that they watch the pod. Like, yeah, you yeah, know what? And to those people, people, we've inspired people out there. And yeah, to yeah, those yeah. people, we love y'all. We love y'all. To the people that don't, we still love you, but it's one of them. Ooh, I. Mm, yeah. You know I mean? See, there yeah. Once again. I'm right. Sorry. And we lost a view. Right. Yeah, Someone like that. <laughs> Just like that. But yeah, let me ask. So we're all in a relationship, right? Yeah. Did you got how? How can I word this question? Mm, yeah. How many red flags would it take for y'all to not have continued with the relationship? Like in a talking stage, how many red flags do you guys accept Depends before you're like, this is not red working? flags were? Yeah, can we, can well, we what, define? What, what, what red flags are there? Go ahead, talk okay, about so, it. you know, manipulation. That's one where I'm... He just, that's a big one. That's, yeah, not, that's, a, that's not the a typical, red flag. Like, a, small... a red flag would be like, they no, 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 but signs of manipulation. No, but signs of manipulation. Forgery. Uh, <laughs> Murder. Uh, you jump right in. Jump right no, nah, but in. signs of manipulation. Like, you can tell if somebody's like. Well, what are signs of manipulation? You know, just seeing how far they go to get their way. Okay. Know? So, okay, what do you. When like you say a really simple situation, like. Let's say, oh, I want to eat here. Uh, you know what? Actually, you picked the last seven places. Why don't I pick today? And I've really been wanting to eat at this place. You deem that as a red flag? Yeah, right? That's like a yeah, typical. Yeah, good, wait, no, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. But listen, <laughs> listen, but listen, but listen, but just how they take, like, nah, I'd rather eat here. Just seeing their mood after, like, if you throw a fucking crazy ass fit, start, like, just acting up like I just told you, hey, by the way, I fucked your sister last weekend. Like, if you acting like that over me saying, hey, I think we should eat here today. That's a red fucking flag. Is it's, it not? It's manipul- I'm, I think but that's mani- No, that's manipulation. I mean, that's he's, because he's, they're trying to help. Like, define, help he's English saying it like this. if they're like emotionally manipulating. Oh, yeah. Okay, like okay. if they make you feel bad and they start crying and acting a fool and it's, it's like, well, then now I feel bad that you feel like this. Yeah, 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 go, yeah. We could do what you want. So like emotional manipulation. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that, crazy like that. I mean, did you? Yeah. I'm sorry. That one went over my head, brother. I was like. You know why it went over his head? Be like, that's what girls do. No, you've been emotionally manipulating Play, <laughs> capture the flag. He tried to capture every flag. <laughs> you were a victim. Oh my gosh. He's a victim. Uh, You're a victim. You had a very traumatic experience, and that, he just he's like, "That's not normal." Like, yeah, that, right? bro. <laughs> that, I, I'm damn. You're supposed to be able to compromise with a motherfucker, bro. Oh, Have a see? conversation and yeah. you know come to a common understanding. Yeah, okay. but that, that's it. Just manipulation. Well, not only that, but just. Gold digging too. I ain't got no money, but how you worry about gold digging? How you worry about gold digging? Because the no there, how you gonna try to What's take the rest of nigga, my? Bro? Listen, how you gonna take the? You can't try to track from zero time. <laughs> exactly, but you're still <laughs> trying to. Dirty James. <laughs> I know you want she my money. My, she gonna take my 06 fours. Exactly. Held together no, by don't play, fucking bro. super don't glue. Take. No, but uh, like gorilla glue. Shout these out to niggas, glue. yeah, no these niggas must not have no red. That's a normal red flag, bro. Somebody taking advantage of you. No, that's you jump, bro. See, look, you would, I, you should have said somebody taking but advantage these, of me as opposed But these opposed are to gold what digging. I'm saying. I'm saying like the situations. This is what they are. Yeah, but I'm just gold explaining like, subjects. I'm just explaining I mean, I subjects. I yeah, just, gold digging is typically rooted in like trying to like get money from somebody. You know what I mean? Yeah, taking but also taking like, advantage. That's of like a broader spectrum. But okay. no, that's not. 
it, it, you. So what? So what do you call? Okay, so I'm Anna Nicole. To be cone Anna, Anna, <laughs> <it's not laughs> <you>. Anna Nicole <laughs> Smith. Okay. She was being a gold digger mm -hmm. for an old ass white man. What was she doing? Taking advantage of that nigga, right? Look, I, I understand. Am I am I wrong? Look, 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 look. You're absolutely right. Gold digger. Then what is the issue? They're, the phrases are not synonymous. Not really, bro. Gold digging has basis in stealing money. Yes. It's not stealing because you're willingly giving it to them. But when, still. But listen. But the whole listen. concept is money. It's money. Listen, it's, but listen but to what got. it's rooted in. I'm using your like of me because I know you like me way more than I like you. And I know that you're willing to give me anything to keep me here. And I just want your money. You and I'm not giving you shit in return. I'm taking advantage of you. I'm gold digging. What? Where am I wrong? You dumb as hell. No, that's not how gold digging works, dumbass. No. What? No, nigga. You only can gold dig for money. We seen the gold digger that's prank. That's what I just said. Go, go on YouTube and watch. I did a gold digger prank. It's the nigga standing in front of a Lamborghini. What am I saying? That does not constitute what the fuck you're saying. Ultima with the donut tape. Oh, no, not me, me nigga. Not me. No, you, bro. No, no. I'm like, saying specifically you, you, you your... Bro, red every red every red flag is a red flag for me, nigga. Why? Oh, let me like, go. Come on, you me to go rock. Ahead, nigga. Throw me to rock. Anyway, damn. <laughs> this nigga didn't know emotional <laughs> emotional your, manipulation was my red flags. Flag. Are, my red flags are really simple. Uh, if I mimic your behavior and you have a problem with it, <laughs> you have a <laughs> and you have a problem with it, that's a red flag for me. Because usually some women, if they see, and this is just from what I did, if I, like for example. There's some girls who, if you mimic their behavior, they'll laugh and they'll be like, damn, I really do that. I need to work on it. Keep moving forward. Some, if you mimic them and then they have an attitude about it, like, why'd you do that? And then you reflect back to, because I'm called petty, because I just don't forget shit. Yeah. So I'll just be like, oh, okay, remember, I remember that you made me feel this way and I'm going to reflect it. It's never something dramatic like, oh, you was fucking on some nigga and I'm going to fuck on some other girl. I've been in that situation, but I'm not talking about that. Yeah. I'm just talking about little things, referring back to your food analogy, right? Mm -hmm. it's, Gold digging with that advantage. Anyways, um, <laughs> what? That's my red flag. It's, it's the money I don't got. <laughs> anyway, gold nigga. digging broke as hell. Anyways, but I'm saying he did think he balling, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga. We y'all said red flag, so I'm just bringing up red flag. I get you. I get you. Bro. No, y'all don't because y'all still going. You, right. I don't, I don't. you don't give me. Nigga. I'm just hopping on his shit. <laughs> I don't really. Like, I, don't got, I know you don't. I'm just back I'm on just, he he first he said emotional manipulation. Not real, yeah, yeah. Bruh, he said, <laughs> you want lost her tonight? <laughs> Bruh. Bruh, I don't. Anyway, yeah. Go ahead. So, for example, like, let's say, like, <laughs> going, back no to your, going back to your food. Let's say you asked her, hey, where are you trying to go tonight to eat? And she's like, well, I'm thinking this or that, right? And then I'm, I'm thinking Chick-fil-A or El Pollo Loco. Random. Just two restaurants get in my head. And then all of a sudden she's like, you know what? I'm feeling flame broiler, right? Even though we've already discovered Chick Fil A and El Pollo Loco, all of a sudden you're throwing a curveball and saying flame broiler. broiler. Now the, let's say the tables have turned, and did she ask me the same question on what I want to eat? And yeah. I give her two, so then she gets comfortable with my two, and then last minute I change it on something completely different. And then she's like, "Why would you do that?" And I thought we're like, up on and you. then she turns up on Man. me, and I'm like, if she does not laugh at the fact I did the same thing she did to her, that's a red flag. That means this is that means you're not. It means you're not aware. Of your actions. That means you yeah. are just living life and not oh, ever looked at yourself in third person. Take it from me. That is a problem that will only get larger. I think yeah, that's absolutely a problem that probably, depending on the situation, might not manifest itself right away. Right, right. But eventually it will like, present itself. It's going to present itself. Ten times out of ten. It's only a matter of yeah, when. Yeah, but I, I feel like, yeah, that's a later red flag, but. Thought we were talking about like instant just, red not, flags. Just red flags like in general. Like, that's it. Like me, I'm a real simple guy, right? Uh -huh. I got two red flags. If, if, if they the girl, don't like Jesus, okay, I got multiple. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, if they don't like Kanye West, yeah, here it is. And they say that up front, that's yeah. my brain automatically shuts off. They're yeah. not for you. They're yeah. not for you. Right, right, right. right. Um, All right, no, some real ones. Or, or if they're that nigga, that's a real one. <laughs> or know. if they're they're turned off to the idea from like understanding him. Okay, like because like Danielle, like she's not the biggest Kanye fan, but she understands like more about what he does through me right, right 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 um if they don't think i'm funny just off top if they don't think i'm fucking I feel that's like a, red that's flag. a reverse that's, yeah, red bro, flag because, nigga, hold on i gotta hear this that's a red flag for me because bro 
I'm so I'm an asshole. Let's just come to terms with that. Okay. Oh, we didn't know that. Let's just come to Almost terms like with a, that. No, baby I'm an mama. Asshole. You need to fix that. <laughs> nah, I'm an asshole. You know you're right? an asshole. Now fix it, nigga. <laughs> yeah. Nah, because it's hilarious. I no, it's, it's not. I, Red so flag. Said, <laughs> so look, <listen, laughs> we go. We go get to that. We go get to that because I'm a giant walking red flag. Right, 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 the right. The biggest red flag you can see. I'm a giant walking red flag, right? Yeah. Which just amazes me, like how far I've gotten in this life, right? But if and they don't think I'm funny, yeah, then I can't rock with you because nigga, I think I'm funny, right? And if they don't think I can dress nice, just point blank. If they're not sitting there saying, "Bro, this nigga fly as hell," then I, my brain is just like they're not for you or they don't think I'm funny don't no, laugh at my jokes like a narcissist bro you checked off that narcissist box so aggressively just <laughs> but, now so you don't, you don't care if you if you if your girl thinks you're funny no I mm. mean it's going Tyrone. no it's going to hurt no time out Tyrone. Tyrone. Listen. <laughs> that boy Tyrone this nigga you told me you don't care somebody don't think nigga. you're funny and I listen get that I was out like bro that if was... I wasn't funny then probably but I know I'm funny okay. if you say listen I... but listen and but I if she think... says you're not funny. I'm be like you're a fucking liar. But okay, and you I'm still, not gonna you think that's a red. Them yeah, I'm funny. not gonna think it's a red flag. I don't. I'm I don't like you pre- because you think I'm funny. If a girl doesn't think I'm funny, then what's the point, bro? I say jokes all the time. At least my kind of jokes. Right. You know what I mean? Do they understand your humor? It shouldn't uh, be they think you're funny. Yeah, nigga. Like, cause what you're. If I'm out the free throw shooting ten free throws, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm yeah, getting yeah. off at least seven of them. You think you you think you seventy percent from the field? I think I'm seventy percent of the field. You're a hot thirty percent <laughs> on a good <laughs> night, <laughs> nigga. But look, you have to understand. Healthy, look, you're a forty percent. We're not gonna go on this tangent, but you have to understand, bro. There's different between stand up jokes and situational funny, bro. Right. I, I understand. I, I understand up. what you're saying, but I'm what I'm saying is, funny. Regardless. just like earlier when I said the EDD shit thinks balling. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. if a girl's sitting there and doesn't laugh at that, bro. Then she's what not if for she me. doesn't? What if she's like she's that's insensitive? What if she said that was insensitive? Look, I. How was I to see? But, but what if she sensitive. said that? Yeah. You, then I'm it's still not for it. me. It's impossible. I don't think you can be around anybody. I've never been around anyone who didn't think anything I said was funny. That's what I'm saying. I, 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 I like I'm like I literally cannot draw a blank. Ex- to there's ever. not one person I've ever been with that said you're not funny. Yeah. So I guess in that. How sense, do you know they're understand. not lying? Then I don't know. Like I don't know is the basis. I don't know. If Cause lying, like low key, what you're lying. what you're saying is kind of like, yeah, I don't want to be with any girl that doesn't think I'm the best dick she's ever had. <laughs> it's not what I'm saying. No, it low key is no. because All listen, but well, wait, listen, hold on, hold on, nigga, listen. Hold on, hold on I got here. Cause she could, you could, she could easily be lying to you, making you think you got the best dick. But you have to. Oh, why, would you wanna, why would you want to be with somebody who doesn't think you you're good in bed? I don't understand that. I'm not. I'm not saying that. I'm saying what you're saying is it's exactly she has to she has yes. to truthfully say you are the funny. But why would you want first of all, why would you want to be with somebody who lies to you? First of all. We talking about red flags. Stay that's, focused. But still, that's a yeah. red flag. I wouldn't want to be with nobody who lies to me. So if they don't think I'm funny, then then that's well, not what if for they you. like you but you put they them in an awkward position like yeah. that. This that's, nigga is not funny, again, but I like it. Like you said, <laughs> we're talking about our red flags. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, my you're red right, flag. You're, you're right. If right. a girl doesn't think I'm funny, then we literally not going anywhere because I say shit that I think you is funny. You say a lot of reckless shit. You say, I do. You have a reckless a time. Re- and thank God I found a girl who understands that or puts up with it. Yeah. Either or. Shout out Danielle. Shout Congratulations out Danielle. on the and graduation. I was talking to Danielle today, bro. She oh, was like, she nigga, said. you're a red flag. You're the biggest red yeah, flag I've damn. ever come in contact she with. She's going to watch this and but be this- like, nigga, you're not funny. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> how, how you going to feel about it? How you going to feel about it? She says, nigga, we're nine years in. That's true. At this point, I could give a you, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> so it ain't that much of a red flag. <laughs> At this point, I could give a Nigga, when you're nine years in a relationship, bro. Like, either you're red flag. Tell that to Kanye West and Kim Kardashian. Hey. Hey, let's not hold bring on. that Give up. It a, don't do that to him. Let's not Why bring you do that, that up. to this man. I'm, I'm just, Why? He, it's the only way he can relate. I come across this, this cool ass skateboard table. Uh, don't I'm bring sorry. that up. Yeah. I'll kick flip off your knees. <laughs> don't bring that up. <laughs> but oh yeah, my. so like I said, when you're nine years in a relationship, bro, red flags either, either have been addressed yeah. or they're just not a big deal. Okay. Luckily, Danielle thinks I'm funny. Yeah. I have my funny moments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I change that. You have your funny She thinks I dress really cool. Yeah. yeah, you know what I mean. So mm-hmm. that's just my personal like that. She doesn't lie to me. At least I don't think she lies to me. She does. She's really good at that it. Is, yeah, that's it, that, bro. <laughs> that, she that's, does. She's really that's good another at red it. flag. You know what red flag? Even, you can't lie. <laughs> no, you a that's bad my, liar. That, that's why you took the words out of my mouth. You're, you're a bad, like, bad liar. You deliberately liars. try and lie, but you're a bad liar. And you're liar. bad at it. That's a red like because I think that every what? woman, every woman is born as a good liar. 
They're born great liars. There's very few women. No, I think they're nah, made nah, into. Not a lot, I think bro. they're I made a lot. into great liars. Not a yeah, lot bro. because I've had my I've come in contact with my fair share of women who've tried to lie and just have not done a good job at yeah, it. Yeah, I but. think women are made into great liars because yeah. their circumstances niggas ain't life. shit. Yeah, exactly. Tell them, Ty. Life, life creates. <laughs> life creates. <them. laughs> Ty it together. <laughs> So much. <laughs> Bro, when we were passing Chef's Choice, I was just like, so if Tyrone has Chef's Choice, is that Ty eating Ty? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that hall was involuntary as fuck. I don't even see. That's how that I know. Hall, I, it was, that's how much you piggy. My body just, that's how much you piggy. My body did not know how to react to it. So the first thing she said, ha. But you see, I cut oh that shit off right after. Gosh. Oh, uh, shit. Hey, bro, get out. Oh, shit. I love Ephraim. my dad. So, uh, <laughs> so. <laughs> I love my jokes, but, bro. So, like, again, I was talking to Dale again because uh -huh. she's the smartest person that I know. Go ahead. Talking go ahead. My mother. Yeah. She was saying that sometimes <laughs> if you, like, absolutely love the person, yeah. and it typically plays into, like, when you're so far into a relationship, then red flags just aren't aren't as big a factor. Yeah, mm -hmm. but where's the line between like that's a red flag and oh that's, that's just, just a characteristic as or no or that's just the, their characteristic. See, like, and where's I that asked, fine line. I ask myself that a lot just in my specific cuz like like I said earlier, you know, I'm I'm an asshole. I think I'm funny, but mm -hmm. I'm 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 mean as fuck. Very true. And you know what I mean? <laughs> and I've kind of carried that a little bit over to my people relationship people. because mm -hmm. I'll say something that I think is funny. Damn, I'll be like, nigga, that's not fucking, that's not funny. Right. But that's different. Thinking I'm generally funny in a general sense or one joke wasn't funny. You know what I mean? But it's like, well, damn, nigga, I, I don't know how else to tell jokes. Like this is, I've always been like this. Right, right, right. See what I mean? So that fine line of, you know, it being a, a characteristic trait or something that can change. I think if you ask, you know, just because we're all men. Yeah. If you ask the women, well, that nigga could change. The fuck mm. he can change. You know what I mean? But if you ask us, it's like, well, I've always been like this. This is a character trait for myself. Uh, when it comes to comedy, I can, I, I you know kind of I mean? see. I, I, but but just niggas, niggas like, change. Niggas yeah. change. I mean, but niggas people, big. People can change. It's niggas big time change. It can change, but it's like. We're well, three examples of it. But then, well, let's say, but then that, that, <laughs> <laughs> but then that comes to like the whole conversation of, well, why are you changing for a relationship? You know what I mean? Like, uh, it, I, now, yeah. That in itself can be a toxic trait, like shaming somebody else's change for betterment. Yeah. You know, but it's all perspective. Yeah, but it, yeah, I, I want to just dabble on that real quick, just for a few minutes. You're saying change, changing for the relationship versus changing because what people are- Who you are. For who you are, because they understand like within the relationship is you, so changing for the relationship is fine. Right. Yeah. And I don't understand why people have an issue with saying I'm changing because of my relationship. Oh, well, yeah, you did. I, bro, I did the biggest <laughs> 180. <laughs> I did. I, bro, I became a new nigga in, in, within a two-month span, span because it's like, yeah, I'm in the, on the surface, I'm changing for the relationship for those who are around me. But understand, in this change is also for myself because I am part of the relationship. Yeah. I don't have to stay like me making this. Let's say, let's say, God forbid, it, me and Key don't work, right? Yeah. In that process, I still learned a lot about another way, another lifestyle that I lived for the duration of the relationship. Yeah. Because that I am part of the relationship. So I never understood when people have an issue with saying, oh, you're changing for a relationship isn't good. You should only change for yourself. Nigga, I'm part of the relationship. Fuck you talking about. I, like, I, I, I feel that. Yeah. I, I, I haven't seen it from that perspective. You know, but I, I, let's, let, let's ask you guys, mm. what what's that fine line? What would be that defining point to where you're either changing for the betterment of a relationship as opposed to changing who you naturally are. Yeah. If you guys have any comments, any thoughts, please comment, DM, send a motherfucking smoke signal. Yeah, something. All or right. send a seagull my way. Yeah, or right? a carrier pigeon. Okay. Yeah, yeah, nigga. Not from LA, bro. The seagull, seagull gonna eat the shit. I'm from LA. <laughs> they got I'm more LA. pigeons than eat seagulls, no, nigga. My just, school only has seagulls. In high school, we only had seagulls. I'm sorry. No, this nigga white. Man. This nigga, no. Yeah, this, he different. Yeah. He different. But look, my mascot was unicorn. Our school was different. I'm not capping. I am not that capping. Explains so Laces much about you. unicorns. A lot. I don't have that. I just, I just want. That's to That's why that. he don't get emotional uh, <laughs> I, abuse. I don't. I did not understand that concept. But whatever. Whatever. We are. All don't, right. Don't so y'all like, do the food in, jokes. In, in the spirit <laughs> of where we are, I want to ask you guys a question. Hip hop. Hip hop. And mm. that's, I mean, come on, bro. Look at where we at. Everything bro. is hip hop. Is fuck, bro. What? what? And this is probably like blasphemous, but I'm asking anyways. Here it comes. 
we've had conversations in the past regarding uh maybe like fake shoes just fake shoes fake right? shoes what are your thoughts is that acceptable fake shoes now before you answer uh-huh think about where we are in fashion yeah you know not saying that babesters are fake but babesters we got revenge storms uh we got all these one silhouettes that have different shit on the side of it yeah think about that and, and you know customizing shoes think about where we are in fashion yeah if you were to go out and get a fake pair of jays mm -hmm. ultra perfect is that bad no you... i think yes because Why? it's not that hard to get jordans you know it's not that hard to get jordans now, SB this nigga Dunks. got his EDD and lost his fucking mind. Nigga, Jordan's is can, nothing. Can <laughs> oh nigga, that's nothing, nigga. Can I talk? <laughs> Fuck. God, he said sneaker rap who, nigga. I go to the store. Anyway, I got it right out the back. Anyway, nigga. but I it's body, not. Nigga. It's not hard to. Hard, it's not bro. that hard to. Now, when it's it comes not hard to. If you the son of the VP of that, Nike, no way. Hard. Now listen. Oh my. Shake God. my hand. <laughs> now, when it comes <laughs> easy, then. when it comes to the other releases, yeah, because those are more limited than J releases. Jays they you, come out in this at the mall. Mm -hmm. Jays come out online. Jays come out at different boutiques. They still doing Jays, Jays like new Jays in the mall. I mean, yeah, you got they the still Carmine. are. Do, yeah, oh, they are. The yes, nigga, out. they do. That's why I'm saying Jays are not hard to get. Now, SB Dunks, Dunks, those are hard to get because you can only get those on the sneaker app. So that means you buy, so your fine now line listen, is just how easy, it is how to easy, get. how accessibility. Accessible. Like if you're going to buy like, I don't know, like fake Team Jays. Do why are you doing that? Nigga. Why are you doing that? It's like, jeans. it's like, do why are you doing that? Fake Team Jays? <laughs> why would they? Why would they do that? Yeah, exactly. But why would they do that? Um, but why would they make Team Jays? No if part? you're, or <laughs> exactly, nigga. No, I know. But why. if you, if you're going to get like, even like fours, like the Columbia fours, you and I are not a fan of those fours, honestly. That's uh, a us, white, explain for the, uh, the blue, blue, blue inside, white, white, white on the post oh, picture. Yeah. yeah. Can't get flagged for that, can we? No, you no, can we say, can't. No, no it's shit, not audio. We, we gotta wait. Audio, we're fine. We gotta wait. <laughs> we're good. No, I've already shown um, just audio. But but yeah, shoes like that, they're not really like desirable shoes, so why would you get fakes of them? Now, if you wanted like bread fours, I understand why you're getting fake bread fours. That's a staple. But even shoe. then, like bread fours aren't typically hard to get, bro. Well, to get a brand new super clean yeah, it's pair, definitely not hard it's to very, get, bro. It's expensive, though. So do we draw the line? At, because it's accessibility. So let's use the Black Cats because we own four land. Yeah, so Black Cat Fours, the, I think you can get a fake pair of Black Cat Fours, and it's all right because they only dropped twice. They dropped 06 and last year. So yeah. they're not but really out there like that. Get a pair of black you can, but they're gonna run you four. To, they're gonna run you four hundred to like six hundred dollars. So you're saying the accessibility? If it's accessibility. easily accessible, exactly. Then, then why don't the fuck do would it. you get it? But then if don't you, do it. If you can't, I mean, I. But because think about it, if you want a pair of Paris Dunks, oh, you're not never happening. gonna get a pair of Paris Dunks. So you're never. <laughs> and in that sense, I can understand why. Because I remember like when the Red Octobers came out, oh. I said, you know, I might as well get a fucking ultra perfect replica. Because one, I'm never gonna be have a chance to get them, yeah. and then two, if I'm walking on the street, niggas are gonna think they're fake. They're anyway. no, no, yeah, they're gonna think they're fake anyways. Because who has red Tiffany Octobers? Dunks, bro? Tiffany, any? Well, fuck it. What's the ones that just dropped? The the ones, which the, ones? The ones that just dropped the fucking with the the, the high fashion, the Dior, oh, ones. the Dior one, Dior, Dior one, Dior perfect, ones. Fucking. Perfect example. Even like the Prada Adidas shell toes. Yeah. Like, so if, if as long as they so accessibility, is, as long as they're if they're not accessible, then it should be okay to, to buy fake. Exactly, yeah. Because, like, honestly, I'm going to be mad if I see somebody wearing, like, a pair of ones with the regular jump man on the back. Like, just go get some fake breads. Why are you going to waste your money on some fake mids? I don't know. Like, I, imagine somebody gets some mid, fake mid I don't know ones. why anybody would do that. But it's crazy because, like, coming up in this in a shoe game, fashion game, you know, fakes were, all, fakes were always seen as, like, don't Taboo do that. Yeah. The yeah. ultimate, the ultimate fuck yeah. no. Yeah. But think about the time they were in. Like everybody, the way you got shoes, you really just had to go outside and get them, and try to get them. You had to put more work in trying to get fakes than to get the actual shoes. The fakes were just as hard to get at one point. You go yeah. back to 2010, 2006 to 2000, maybe 13, 14. Yeah. Getting yeah. fakes was not. It's hard. It's hard. Like cause don't, understand, there was no offer up like it was like it is today. There was and no Craigslist like, was creepy. Sneakers as shit. app did not exist. No. They think about but they that. had the they had the Jordan. Um, the only J23. thing you had was it was the, the Jumpman. What was the website? Jumpman. The Jumpman, Jumpman one twenty three. Twenty. Yeah. That was the only at one where you can get it. Fucking or if you happen to know a nigga at Fight Club, and that means you had bread. 
Yeah. So uh, that's a different discussion. So if you don't, uh, I said Fight Club, Flight Club. Yeah, yeah I said Fight Club. Brad Pitt was about that. Brad Pitt was about to pop up. Talk about Brad Pitt was about to pop up. First rule of Flight Club is we don't talk about it. Yeah, honestly. Nah, but yeah. like, yeah. But bitch. <laughs> 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 no, but I get you like, the way the game was back then is like you really had to know somebody. You had to know somebody. And who even had to get still, a today, because like you brought up a good point. Like, unless you're the uh, son of an exec at Nike, yeah. look at Dumb that ass. situation. Look at that situation and tell me if you can empathize or sympathize with somebody that bought fake shoes because a nigga like that purchased all the whole run, <laughs> the entire run I, I would of say what the, they the, wanted. The you reselling game. Has made it a little bit more. Has made it a lot more difficult for yeah, just regular bro. people. To people take shoes. People, to get it's so That's bad that to people look forward to taking L's. People look forward to not getting shoes after they stayed up till seven a.m. trying to get some shoes. Asked like fifteen of their family members to try to get some shoes. They're like, I didn't get the shoe, and it's not that I couldn't afford it. Yeah, it's just that. I wasn't some, able to. I tried. I was there. I was in line. Or there's some fucking hacker who owns, who, who has a bot and shit. took it out of your Shout cart. Shout out Lido. I'm so, <laughs> right. So you I just was, want this nigga to get jumped. <laughs> <laughs> you either going to get business so, or get shot, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's one or the other. So all in all, it just comes down to based off the times we're living in, yeah. where reselling is kind of the curve of the, the curve of it's getting the norm. regular shit. It's the That's norm. insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it would be it, getting fake shoes isn't as. Is, uh, Taboo as it used to be. I don't Not think at all. So. Not at all. And I think that's why you have so many remakes on Alibaba with the ones that yeah. is because and people then like, are like YG with the Cortezes and shit. Yeah, the it's Cortezes like and shit. Bortezes. Yeah, but right. yeah. Bortezes. <laughs> but people want this shoe. They want this shoe because they like it. I actually commend somebody that's going out of their way to buy a fake shoe because they like it because they're getting ready to face scrutiny for wearing a fake shoe. They have to go out their way to buy a fake shoe. You paid like. 180 to 200 dollars for a fake shoe when the shoe dropped at a hundred dollars and like i don't know like you in yourself it's an inner battle it's like damn i gotta buy fake shoes now you well, can't even comfortably me, wear the shoe because me, you like niggas might think these is fake but let me cut you so now i'm happy you see it on the consumer side now you're a designer mm -hmm. and somebody i'm happy i i can't comfortably i can't comfortably say i'm happy because understand when Virgil dropped his bread once, mm -hmm. there was a limited run. Uh, what about a situation where Nike literally does the friends and family? Like, you're not supposed to have these. That, I'm not, but I'm not mad but we at can't, that. We can't draw that line at, well, that, that there was not designed, there was no, not but listen, any accessibility. That right there, I'm not mad at that because, yo, I seen that, that is hard. I'm hurt that I can't have it. I wish I could wear it. I can't. But he's so saying, yeah, like, I'm a cop of fake shoes. Like, but on the designer like, side, that's not like you're not bootleg. made to have. You're not made to have for, that. Well, for a f friends and family, no money is coming out of your pocket watching somebody buy that fake shoe because Nike made that for you. They said, hey, you got to select few people. Mm -hmm. This is no money you put into so it. So essentially, if somebody was to bootleg a friends and family, the designer, they're not being. They can't be angry. No, a no, regular person no, would never. No, I completely place, disagree. I completely. And you, as an artist, I understand you don't understand this because you because make art this, is for the people. No, if you have a friends and family pack, if I make a friends and family fucking cone hoodie, mm -hmm. right, and I make it, or I make a DDS for only the niggas who participate in DDS, mm -hmm. right, and I see a nigga who has a DDS cone hoodie, mm -hmm. I'm not like, hey, bro, shouts out to making your own. Fuck you. You weren't part of the team. Now think of it like this. Even Kanye. Kanye, think remember a nigga brought the fake yeah, air yeah, yeah, he, he said these are fake. And he still signed them, yeah, but, but he said these are but fake. But think of it like this. Same people who you give those friends and family to, some of them might sell that friends and family shoe. Yeah. Now how do you feel? No, that's it. But understand what me. Is it really different? Because it's the same sentiment. It's something I made for my friends and family. Right. A nigga that you gave it to, that you expected to cherish it, sells it because they know the profit. To somebody who saw it and was like, I really appreciate that shoe. I want to wear that shoe. Nah. Let me get that. Nah, I'm not I'm not disagreeing for the sake of the show. I I think yeah, I, 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 I get understand. where you're coming from. I get where you're yeah. coming from on like you on like accessibility, but on the designer side, when like that's I really think that's why Virgil signed all his fucking shoes. Cause he'd be like, No, I know I gave this to you. Yeah. That's my fucking and that's why he did that dumb yeah. shit. Like that's, that's why he did that's it. why he did he it. Also, I, I know he does not, there's no way in hell you can tell me you like fakes. It, I, no, I, I understand what he's saying because it's like if I go out of my way and create this art for the world, you know, I do it out of my soul, out of my heart. Yeah, right. To see somebody else on the side of me do this shit, mm -hmm. like bootleg Straight my profit. shit, and speaking and for, get profit off yeah. of 
the shit that's coming from my soul, yeah. I don't rock with that shit. But speaking from somebody who like wants to do this shoe shit, who really wants to be in this shoe shit, and your your whole aspect is as long as I want to see people wearing my shoe. Yeah, generally that's why I created the shit. I'm gonna say this. I want to see I, people. Like, I understand both your guys' points. I think your shit is complete bullshit. I'm not even gonna front. <laughs> no, no, I'm serious <laughs> because, though. Like, nigga, if I come out and make art, like I make these straps, right, and mm-hmm. I make this shit out my soul for the betterment for the people, I'm gonna be hella hot if somebody on the side of me is doing this shit. It's like it's like we're hip hop, bro. But that's different. We that's rappers. you in house making See, that's a what shoe. I'm saying. We're talking about me. I'm at Nike and I'm making a shoe through Nike. I'm not even getting all the revenue. How can I be mad? No, it, but like, but that's what I'm saying. I don't mind. Is that I don't mind. I understand where you're coming from. Now that goes into the the artist's royalties deals and things of that nature. Yeah, my like money's already if I'm taken. Getting, care if, let's say, yeah. let's say if I'm getting, let's, if I'm get, if I'm doing royalties on my shoe, right, yeah. per unit, and there's niggas making units that have not gone through Nike, I got an issue. I'm already I got an listen, issue. But how about this? You get the, that royalty deal, but what Nike doesn't tell you is. We're not retroing this shoe for another 15 years. Whatever. You I, can't be mad, nigga. No, no. I, you I'm can't not, be not, mad. And, and trust me, and this is the, this is so weird. This is the demarcation line for me. Bootleg t-shirts. Like the old bootleg t-shirts from back in the day. Like the like, the, like, like Dapper Dan. Yeah. Bootleg nigga, Gucci I shit. love them. I fucking love them. Dang. But I don't. When it comes to uh, shoes. Me, when then, it comes to shoes, I'm. And then mm. like with music. When was the last time you bought an album? Oh shit! Not only that, but like even before, not, not, not even that, That's bro. Just think of Lil <laughs> Wayne. <laughs> Time out. See? Not so, even that, but Lil Wayne's dedication. Uh, uh, Lil uh, Wayne's dedication. Uh, no uh, ceilings. Yeah. Like, bro, how can you be mad? He literally ripped songs from people. I, I, and remade music. Them, like, music is in that is in that weird that, space that, for me. But that's like weird he didn't rip the lyrics, but he ripped the beat. You know, no, that's I, different. Music, music How is you a think weird the space. The producer felt he didn't get paid. For uh, that. That's different. Mm-hmm. I think that's different because even when like let's say like Run This Town with Jay Z, like he said like I'm gonna give Wayne this beat. Yeah, he I did. think I think in that specific yeah, aspect, people yeah, were cool. happy that Wayne chose. We their were beat happy, to go but over. look at where even in mixtape era we were. We were coming to that point where niggas like this shit is cool, but prior to that tape, niggas were mad. That this, yeah. that's what that I'm saying. You bringing that up, bro. Producers are mad if their song is ripped and they're not getting any kind of, yeah. uh, you know what I mean? It's like that's like what yeah. he's that's, saying. That is like what he's saying. But for producers, it's different because each, um, each play that comes straight from them. That's their royalty, royalty, whatever. That's only if they get credit for it, bro. But if that's another because they created not it from credit. That's true. But they created that beat from ground up. I'm in Nike's office. Nah, fuck that. They fuck said that. Hey, I, I mm-hmm. think he's talking mm-hmm. more of a bigger, on a bigger level, like he Tinker Hatfield yeah. level, as opposed to, okay. to okay. VP of Nike. If it's yeah. Tinker, <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, well, no, no, Tinker Hatfield opposed to, really what you're talking is Tinker over like Travis and Virgil. Because you're not really talking Virgil because Tinker literally built this shoe. Right, right. He literally built this well, shoe. Yeah, it, For Tinker, but, I understand where but, the angle is. That's, that's that, that, from, from the creator. nigga, whoever that fly. That, yeah, right, that fly is like, <laughs> he, oh, he's, he's, he's trying to get, get, right? get an episode. Look, from, from, from a designer aspect, from a creator aspect, I don't rock with it at all. Mm-hmm. Fake or not, fuck you. No. Right? Yeah. Coming from a consumer on the other side is like, well, damn, I'm never going to be able to get this shoe anyways. I might as well just go buy some fake shit, right? Me being who I am, coming from, coming from I'm vain as fuck. I don't rock with fakes at all. Period. I'll say I want to get a fake shoe, but when it comes down to it, bro, I'm not I'm doing probably it. Probably not gonna do. I'm just yeah. gonna chuck it up and say, "Fuck it, that's just not for me." Yeah. But with this evolving fashion world, bro, it seems like fake is is more acceptable. Now. But this is what this is my my combat for those who are considering buying fake things. You don't necessarily have to buy something that's fake. You just have to buy a beater. Me See, and, and but this like nigga, I said, a lot like of I people said, don't don't like that. And I'm saying when you truly have appreciation for the culture and you cross that line in the fake. I wonder if you even appreciate the culture. See, now, nice. if, let's say you don't have the money to buy a brand new Ford. You don't have the money to buy the black cats, but you can find some 06 blue and whites because you appreciate. He didn't go buy fake ones. He went and be like, look, those aren't in my budget, but I have appreciation for the culture. I'm buying 06. I, yeah. I know. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. but well, even that, the me finding the 06, that was oh just God. complete luck. Yeah, but still, because you know why? You appreciate the culture. But yeah. You appreciate having a bad pair of real piece of culture. That's definitely true. But like, I kind of don't want to knock these kids because a lot of these kids come from a place where their parents will look at them crazy. Even if the shoe just dropped for like 160, they'll miss that drop and they'll like end up making the money. And they're like, damn, no. I can't afford it. No, I got to buy the fake. Let, no, let, no. let me let me we're going to extend the question to y'all. How do you guys feel about fake shoes? Fake anything in general, but specifically, would you buy them? Would you wear them? What are your thoughts on it? And 
Also, DM us, comment us, let us know. If you're buying fake shoes to have a trash fit, then that's just yeah, that, bad. That's a completely If thing, you got but, fake shoes and your fit cool, then. But we're, we're going to get up out of here. We've given y'all a lot to think about. A lot to ponder, a lot please to consider. Please comment, please engage. I'm yeah. asking you to please engage. Just subscribe. Um, yeah, y'all don't like me. As, 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 as always, me. I've been your ever gracious host, Teams. Oh, whoa. He's not gracious. He's and been your co host, Augusto Cole. <laughs> and I'm the gracious. other co host, yeah. Big Wolf. Nigga. That's here to tell you this nigga is lying. I, he I, don't like y'all more than I don't like y'all. Yeah, right. Yeah, you continue to we just. Love y'all. We love y'all. We love y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Same breath you have them to I do it in their face. You do it behind their face. <laughs> always remember. Oh, yeah. Stay happy <laughs> and stay optimistic. Usually, I why'd you look at him? We're talking about why'd you look I was like, wait. He I'm fucked a, me up because uh, you said the hate. Yeah. You looked at him. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> Every time. I hit the, uh, it's right, cool. Every I hit the, uh, yeah, end recording. Because like, <laughs> you, you look. We're not sitting in order. <laughs> you looked at him, I was like.